So, here today to uh, talk about the up and coming Left Hand Path Consortium. And it looks like if I'm reading off the computer, I am because I'm about to tell you what's up. Uh, I've made a couple of videos about this before, but the lineup's changed, but um, it's still going on. It's still going to be good as ever. Um, what we got going on is it's in Atlanta, Georgia, April 8th through the 10th. So, that is, yeah, April 8th through the 10th, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. It's a three day event. There's going to be all kinds of musicians presenters giving uh, speeches and lectures on you know the various topics that they specialize in um, it's gonna be a masks ball there's gonna be a party it's gonna be a VIP room live music artists writers I mean they really put this together uh, so here's what's going on on Friday um, it is from 10 o'clock to 11 o'clock a person named Carrie Lynn who's gonna be talking about Native American dark legends from 11 o'clock to 12 o'clock we have somebody called LB Kenobi <laughs> clever uh, dark Wiccan and then we're going to take lunch. And then from 1 to 2 o'clock, we have Toby Chappelle. hope I spelled it. I said that right. Starry Wisdom, Left Hand, Starry, Starry Wisdom, Left Hand Path, and Lovecraft. That sounds interesting. I'm really looking forward to seeing that. From, and that's from 1 to 2. And from 2 to 2.30, that's to be announced. And then we take a 30-minute break. And then we come back from 3 to 4. We have Typhon Dragonus. Draconus. Uh, a casual sorcery, and he's one of the hosts that's actually putting it on. And then from 4 to 4.30, you have yours truly, Zach, myself, and I'm going to be talking about modern Satanism. That's a very general term. Um, I'm going to be covering a lot of different grounds, <clears throat> uh, talking about Satanism after LeVay, current state of Satanism, the need to believe, psychology, religion. Um, you know, it's kind of going to kind of be a surprise. Nobody really knows what I'm going to talk about, not even me. So I'm from 4 to 4.30. Then we have the main ballroom. And from uh, 5 to 5.30, we have Caleb Storms. Ego masking is power. Okay. And then from in the main ballroom, from 5.30 to 6, we have a ritual called Mask of the Black Sun with... Let me open that. Mask of the Black Sun with Caleb Storm. Sounds interesting. Black Sun. So uh, let me go to the next... Okay, so, okay, okay, wait, wait, go back. Sorry, I gotta keep opening and closing this thing. <clears throat> okay, so, at night, at 7 o'clock, we have our musicians. We have Andrew Wiseman, Rhythm of Drum, African Drumming, Workshop and Music. Uh, Solarium is my, my homeboy, Shea Belay. He's an alchemist of word and sound, performance of Avante Garde, Neofolk, Dark instrumental fusion and agro poetic lyricism. I've seen Shea play. Um, I've heard his music. It's fucking excellent. It's very dark. It has a great spoken word. And at 9:30 we have Seven Factor, which is a global multimedia, user-driven art project centered around a touring industrial metal band, portrayed through various media formats. All right. And then we have in the ballroom again. We have oh great another name. Uh, a cruis mortorium, mortem, something like that. Um, seething blackened metal act with intentions of creating melodic <clears throat> yet punishing extreme metal, pulling on influences from classical and tech death metal, grindcore, thrash, and black metal. Wow, that's interesting. No, no, it's going to be there. So Saturday we have um, most of our headliners. From ten to eleven we have Mona Magic. The Soul, Genealogy, Relationship, and Responsibilities to the Gods. From 11 to 12, we have Corvus Nocturnum. Hail thyself, unlocking the secrets of control, wealth, and power. I believe Corvus Nocturnum is Church of Satan, folk. Not positive, but I do believe so. Okay, then we have lunch. And then 1 to 2.30, we have Thomas Carlson, Ph.D., founder of Dragon Rude. The Left Hand Path and the Dark Side of Religion, How Sinister Spirituality were, Will Unfurl the world presentation with a 30 minute question and answer session. Let me take a break. And then from 3 to 4 30, we have Edgar Edgar Kerval. Shamanism, the Red God's experiences working with sexual liberations in blood. Presentation with a 30 minute question and answer. Uh, break. And then we have Craig Williams, Alchemy and Vama Marja. Break. And then we have Thomas Carlson, PhD. Again, he's doing a ritual. Excellent. Okay, the right of Lilith, Leviathan, and Lucifer. And then on Sunday, our final day, oh, I'm sorry, Saturday night, we have our mask ball, which is very going to be very cool. 
it's kind of like the eyes wide shut mass ball, you know. Um, let's see, a chance, left hand path, girl, the finest, and spin the everybody, the presenters, the guests, um, you know, will all be there. And mind you, this is a private event. It's not open to the public. You have to buy tickets. The only thing that's open to the public is the art gallery. So, yeah, all this stuff that I'm talking about here, you need a ticket for, and it's a private event. We don't want stray cats wandering in, you know, causing problems or anything. So, you know, we have our own security. It's private. Uh, and then we have hotel security. So we'll have the mass ballroom. We have live, live music by Eyes of Legia, Project F, and Claren Arts. Uh, looks like it's going to be some rock industrial music. Um, uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, it's going to be a few different types of music. Um, finally, on Sunday, April 10th, the last day, 10 to 11, we have Lucas Grochoki. hope I said that right. I'm sure I fucked that up. The Fire Fountain System in Theory and Practice. 11 to 12, Rachel Summers, Godless Witchcraft Literature. And we go to lunch, and then 1 to 2, we have Jake Block. Uh, from there to here, and I'm, I'm pretty sure what that means is he's going to be talking about his days uh, in the early days, well, you know, when he was involved with the Church of Satan uh, before Anton LaVey died. That's probably what he's going to be talking about. I, I heard that he's going to be bringing pictures and stuff, and never before some pictures of Anton LaVey. So it should be cool. I always like listening to Jake's stories about the uh, good old days of the Church of Satan. Then from two to three, we have Reverend Bill Dovenduck, the Babylonian Belial Connection. Break. And then the last performer, it looks like uh, 3.30 to 4.30, Robert Podgurkist, a notion magic and left-hand path. And then we'll have closing with uh, Lori the host and Tycon the host. So again, it's... um. You know, it's a three-day event. It's two hundred dollars to get in. I'll send to put links in the video description below, so that you know uh, where you can go to buy your tickets. Oh, and another thing is, if you're a uh, a vet, you don't even have to be active service. Any type of vet or active service, you get in for free, just free. You know, um, you, you're welcome to get a hotel with us. We encourage you to. We have a room block, so all the guests and entertainers, presenters, musicians, all that stuff, we're all going to be staying like on the same floor together. So you know, the after hours party is going to be cool. You know, we you know. We're going to, you know, we have like the ballroom, uh, we have the bar. So, you know, I, I, it would be wise of you to uh, get a hotel room there so that you can be with all of us. Because it's going to be one like three day party, you know, uh, from what I hear, the nighttime party is pretty cool. So if you have any questions, uh, get a hold of me uh, personally. My email is Satanic International Network at gmail.com. Or you can uh, go through the link below to buy tickets and uh, I'll see you there.